What is up you guys, Matt from my process and guys today I have a brand new video for my reselling journey number four. I don't know if you guys have been following my content lately but in these past couple months I've really been getting into supreme reselling and just overall just streetwear reselling in general. Um, so you guys I have a really really cool um, you know, story for you guys today and basically I want to tell you guys about um, how I resold a supreme item that I copped in less than 45 minutes and you know this was like the fastest that I've ever resold a um, any item in that I've ever gotten um, from shoes to supreme I've, I've never flipped anything this fast so I did it through this through this one method that I'm about to tell you about in the story um, so basically guys you know starting off the story I um, you know supreme was dropping another collection of items you know every every Thursday at 11 a.m. and they just dropped um, this new collection that they were doing, but they were doing a collaboration with with like Fox Racing, with like Fox Racing or something like that, and um, like everything on the collaboration, like nothing was really um, like signing for re -signing for that much. So I kind of thought of this week as like a break or whatever. I, I didn't really think that anything was gonna be good for me to cop, but I, but I saw something else that was dropping. It was actually it was actually an accessory that you know they that they dropped on, on on that Thursday, and it was a jar set, right? It was a set of two jars. I mean, it was a set of two jars, and it was really really cool. Um, and a lot of people really, really, uh, th really thought it was gonna be, you know, it was gonna resell for, a, you know, a good amount, a good price, like more, more than it was going to re re retail for. Um, and, and you know, this high item was like really, really hyped up because a lot of people, you know, like that supreme thing. They can put it in their house. They can use it for everyday use. They can do whatever they want with it. Um, you know, I decided, you know, I'm gonna try and get this. Uh, I'm gonna try and get this. You know, this, this set of two jars, right? I'm, I'm in school, whatever. I think I'm in my free period, so that was really, really clutch. Um, so I'm in my three period right now, you know, 11, 11 a.m. hits. I'm already on the accessories page on the Supreme website, just like refreshing, refreshing, refreshing. Um, the, uh, the jar pops up and I click on it and I add it to my cart and I check out and I put in all my information like really, really quickly. Um, and I check out, um, and it's processing or whatever. And you know, I was like, you know, I was like, again, like I, I'm still, you know, not fully acclimated to, um, you know, the, uh, the stress of Supreme drops every Thursday. So I was still a little scared and shaking and stuff like that. And it was processing, it was through his little loading bar and whatnot. And then it finally, um, gave me the message and it said, thank you. Um, you know, thank you for buying with Supreme, whatever, like, you know, the, the, you know, the jar set of two, the Supreme jar set will, will come in, you know, in three to five business days, whatever. So, you know, again, I was like super, super happy that I, that I got the Supreme, you know, jar set and I was really, really excited. And, you know, like every, like every other, um, item that I cop on, that I get on Supreme, um, you know, I usually wait for it to come in and I'll take some pictures of it. I'll put it on my eBay and I'll put up my Grailed account. And you know, hopefully, you know, by then it will sell. Um, and, and you know, it will sell and whatnot. But a problem that I've been facing is recently I've I've, ha I've been having trouble reselling some of these items. Um, not that you know these items aren't going for anything higher than the retail price, but more it's just like getting people to come and look at my page and coming to you know look at my Grail account and my eBay account and stuff like that. Um, and and, and liking the price that I was being put. Um, but you know, so recently, guys, I've been having trouble selling some of my Supreme items. I was trying to find you know different alternatives to trying to um, to try to you know sell my to sell the items that I'm getting that I'm trying to resell. You know, so after the drop, I was just on Instagram like scrolling through, like trying to see you know what other people had got, like some of the pictures of some of these items that I had dropped on Supreme. Um, and I was scrolling through, and I see, and I, and I follow a lot of these like Supreme, um, like the big Instagram accounts, like Supreme accounts. Um, that just post pictures of Supreme stuff and also post, you know, um, some retail estimates, some retail estimates, um, and just overall just, you know, talk about the whole Supreme brand in, in general. Um, and I follow all these big accounts, um, and I, I've never really seen this before, or I've seen it and I've never really been interested in it before, but, you know, one of these accounts that I saw, one of these Supreme accounts had posted, it's called a what to buy or what to sell post, right? So in the, on the picture, it was like the, the most recent drop on it, and it said WTS slash WTB, ask in the comments or whatever. So I was like looking through the comments, and it was like WTS, like Supreme Pants, or WTB, um, like the jar or whatever, and I realized that WTS and WTB mean what to sell and what to buy, right? So I was like, oh, okay, like these people who are looking to buy something put WTB, you know, the jar, right? So I was looking at these comment section and there was like hundreds and hundreds of comments being being loaded like every single second that I like refreshed it and stuff, I guess, because, you know, people are either trying to buy these things that I had just dropped on the Supreme website or they're trying to sell something that, that they had just copped on the website. And, and, and I was looking through them and I was like, oh my God, like this is, this could be a really, really great opportunity for me to sell my, to sell my thing like really, really quick, you know, really, really quickly. You know, so I started looking at all these people and, and I guess, you know, so many people were interested 
and buying this, you know, Supreme jar set. I, you know, for some odd reason, you know, what I'm saying, and and I guess because it was like, you know, the biggest hyped, the, the most hyped item in the entire drop. So I guess people were really, really interested in in in, in um in buying um you know the the jar set from people that had copped it from the Supreme drop. Um, so you know, a bunch of people were like WTB, you know, what to buy, um, Supreme jar set, you know, DM me or whatever. Um, so I was responding, and there was like hundreds of these comments, right? And I responded like every single one of them. You know, I would say, you know, I would, I would, um, you know, I would respond like I would, I just DM'd you with an offer, or I just DM'd you, you know, check it out or whatever. Um, and I would DM these these people who are looking to buy the jar set. In, in me selling it, I wanted to try and stand out from all the other people that were trying to sell that jar set to them. So I tried to add a little bit more value than all the other people were at, were adding. I, you know, and I'd make sure use their name as well. So I'd be like Kyle. You know, I will sell you know this set of Supreme jars to you along with. Um, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll send you the, uh, the Supreme bag that it comes with as, as well, and I'll also send you this, the limited di edition, um, your Supreme stickers, um, and, you know, and, and also, you know, just to keep, you know, your glass, you know, your glass jar from breaking, you know, I'll, I'll make sure to put, um, I'll make sure to ship it safely with extra wrapping around, you know, your, su your Supreme jar, so, it, so you get it, you know, to your house with no scratches, no breaks, anything. Um, and stuff like that. Now, I basically send this message, you know, this mass DM to so many different people, um, so that you know, and because what I, what I was trying to do, I was trying to get as many, um, as many sellers as as many buyers as possible. You know, what I'm saying because a lot of people might not, um, you know, be interested in the price that I was asking for and whatnot. So you know, I tried to go a little higher because I knew how many options that I had from all these different buyers. Um, so this one guy I was talking to, and you know, so he was like, he was like, hey, you know, um, how much do you think that this would that you would sell the jars to me for? And I was like, and you know, I'll sell it to you for for ninety, including everything that I mentioned above. And you know, he was like, okay, yeah, it seems interesting, whatever. Um, and I, um, and he was like, oh, he was like, so what's your PayPal, right? So he was like ready to pay, but for some reason, I, you know, in the beginning of this, like I was like, you know, hey, can you buy it from my Grail account or my eBay account? Um, because he had, because I'm trying to get like good reviews on those things as well. And he was like, oh, you know, okay, sure, you know, um, you know, I can buy it on those things if you'd like me to. Um, and then, you know, I'm like making the eBay post or whatever. And then five minutes later, he DMs me and he was like, hey, my man, you know, I got an offer for $65 on the Supreme Jar set. Um, and I'm gonna go ahead and go with that offer. Um, and I was like, oh, damn, like I was so, you know, I was so close to, to you know, to closing that one guy. And he would, and, and this message really, really changed my whole outlook of how I'm gonna do this. And he was like, Barry, you just gotta be quick, my man. Like, I, I was ready to pay you immediately. Um, you know, I was ready to pay you immediately, you know, asking for your PayPal and you wanted me to go to your different platforms. Like, you really have to just, you know, go with, you know, go with that initial deal right away. Um, so I was like, oh my god, like, you know, this guy's like 100% right, like, he was ready to pay and I didn't take advantage of that opportunity. You know, so basically, guys, you know, I immediately changed my tactic of how I go into this. Uh, again, I was DMing all these different people and whatnot. I had so many people that were like, you know, responding to my DMs, like, okay, how much are you doing, how much are you doing? But, you know, I was really dedicated to making, you know, a good amount of money off of this one thing. Um, so I... You know, so like I said, um, you know, so this one guy and he responds like no less than like 15 seconds later, and he was like, "Hey, man, man, like how much? You know, are you asking for? You know, for the Supreme Jar set?" And I was telling him like 90, you know, and so then I basically told him like 90 for everything I mentioned above. So you know, he, you know, so he was like, "Okay, you know, it sounds like a, that, you know, he's he was like, "Okay, that sounds like a good price." So I was like really surprised at that. Um, but he was like, you know, did you? So he was like trying to figure out more about exactly, you know, what I'm about, you know, every all the details and whatnot. And he was like asking me, you know, how, how long it would take to ship. You know, do you have them in hand or not in hand? But basically, like, I was just trying to sell him on the idea, like, hey, my man, like, I don't have it in hand right now. Like, I don't have it with me, but it's shipping in three days. Um, and in the moment that I get it in my hands, I will immediately, you know, run to the post office and send it to you. Um, and make sure that everything is safe and sound so that you, you know, can get this Supreme Jar set as fast as possible. You know, so I was really trying to sell him on this idea. So then he was like, he was like, okay, you know, it sounds great, right? So I was like, okay, you know, does PayPal work? Because that's like the fastest way to do the transaction through PayPal. And I was like, okay, you know, does PayPal work? He was like, okay, great. So then I, you know, I sent him my email or whatever. Um, and I was like, hey, brother, like, you know, and I was trying to get a little bit more money out of him because I know that one, I'm going to have to pay for shipping. And then two, there's also a little bit of a transaction fee in PayPal, not too, too much. Um, so basically, you know, I, I asked him, I was like, hey, my man, like, do you think that, you know, we could maybe in, instead of $9, you could pay, you could pay $100 just to pay that shipping cost and just to pay the transaction fee as well. Um, he was like, honestly, my man, like, 
coming into this, I didn't even want to spend more than $80 on this thing. If you have to sell it to me for 100 I, I probably have to start looking at other sellers who are selling the Supreme Jar set and stuff. So I was like, okay, no, I completely understand. And I asked him, I was like, how does 95 work? Um, and, and, I was, and I was worried because he didn't respond to me for a good like five, six minutes. And, and, like, and, and in real time, like, I was like thinking that this was like, oh, this, this offer was done. Like I was already starting to you know, DM other people and stuff. And then I get a notification on my phone for my email and it said $95 has been transferred to your PayPal account. Um, and I was just ecstatic, guys. I was just amazed right? that I had been able to sell it for that, for that much, for that price, in that quick of an amount of time, right? I was not only able to buy it, but I was also able to resell it in less than 45 minutes. Um, you know, just by doing um, like everything that I mentioned, you know, with going on Instagram and doing this, what to what to sell, what to buy stuff. I know, you know, obviously for all reselling, it's probably not applicable. But you know, if you're doing supreme reselling or shoe reselling or any of that world, you find these big social media accounts who who post uh, pictures of basically it's a marketplace of people trying to buy and resell and whatnot. Basically, guys, you know the uh, you know the tip that I would give to any of you guys who are trying to resell is you know, if you're trying to resell something, you know, go on Instagram and find these niche accounts. And you know, say like, "Hey guys, I'm selling this, um, you know, this this uh, really cool nature bracelet. I'm sure you know a lot of you guys are interested in, uh, in in this whole world of nature and stuff. So like, you know, d um, I'd love you know DM me if you're interested in buying something um, that has to do with nature and stuff like that. Go on, if go on a nature account to do that, or you know, pick whatever niche it is and go on Instagram and try and sell. Go in the comment section and type like, "Hey, you know, hey, I have this niche product." And you know, I'd love to sell it to you guys, and you know, there's a ton of value behind it, and give them value and whatnot. So, guys, like, that's just a way that I, um, you know, that I just discover on how you know I'm gonna start doing this going on Instagram and, and going to these, um, these big supreme pages and, and and start DMing a bunch of these people who are interested in buying, um, you know, that one that one product that I have. And, and the really really cool thing about this as well is because you know, with eBay and with Grail, anytime that you sell something, they take a, a percentage of the amount of money that you sold that one that, that one item for. So let's just say I sold you know, an item for a hundred dollars. Uh, you know, Grail or eBay takes ten percent um, of that $100. Um, so yeah, guys, I don't know if you guys knew, but the uh, the Supreme Jar set was re was retailing for like $34, and then plus shipping it was $45. Um, so I was able to you know resell it for $95, um, and you know meaning that I make you know around 40 you know 40 you know 30 40 dollars just off of this one jar that I bought you know off of uh, off of Supreme and stuff, which is amazing. I you know I basically just made 30 40 dollars in a matter of 45 minutes, which is absolutely amazing, right? Um, you know, so that was, you know, that was really, really cool and uh, amazing experience as well. So, I mean, so yeah, guys, I mean, you know, for any of you guys who are reselling or any, any of you guys who are, you know, just doing anything with, with reselling in general, like, you know, use that, use that one, you know, use that one tip and I'm sure it will, you know, get you a lot of people who are interested in actually buying, um, you know, your, that item that you're trying to resell. Um, and, and just make sure that, and I think you know the the thing that I really learned from this whole from this whole um, from this whole process of being able to do it in 45 minutes is you have to be quick, right? Like you can't be dragging the conversation on because you'll be having other people that are gonna want to sell that same product for a lower price. So you really have to sell them as quick as you can and get them, your, you know, give them your information and let them pay as quick as possible before they even see any of the other you know cheaper offers that other people are giving them. Um, so, you know, yeah, guys, like, it's so funny, I was able to learn, um, learn, and then also apply what I learned from that one loss to the first guy that had turned me down, and then immediately, like, five minutes later, I was able to, you know, finally, um, you know, sell another person on it in a really, really quick way and efficient way to where, I, you know, he, he ended up buying it in a matter of, like, five, six minutes, and to apply this to basically everyone, um, like, if you are in a competitive niche, right? If you're running a business, if you're pursuing a dream, right? There's always going to be people who are competing against you in that world, especially in business and stuff. Like you have to be quick. You know what I'm saying? You have to be quick with your sale. You have to be quick with you know the people that you are trying to sell to because one, you're you're spending their time. You're spending their time. You're spending their time. Um, trying to sell them and if you don't sell them quick enough they're gonna get disinterested or they're gonna have other businesses come and say hey you know um, you know we give even more value for even a lower price and stuff like that but you want to be able to do it fast enough to where they don't even have the option to um, to even go with these other people because they already signed with you or they already bought your or they already bought your products or they already you know bought your um, resold item or whatever so you know whatever it is guys just be quick with your sale. 
um, and try to be as efficient as you possible as you possibly can. Whether it's you know with a cli a potential client that you're trying to get, or a or a buyer, or a you know whatever it is, um, you know, or or a customer, you know whoever it is, guys. Um, just trying to be as quick as possible because you know there's so much competition that is out there that if you don't do it quick enough, other people will start coming in your way, um, and you will you know get potential clients, like a potential big clients could be taken away from you, or customers can be taken away from you just like that. Um, so guys, I hope you guys can apply that to your life and your dreams and your business or whatever it is that you're doing in your life. Um, and I'm, you know, and, and, and basically, you know, the overall videos, you know, that is how I, you know, bought and resold a Supreme item in less than 45 minutes. I hope this added value to you guys, um, you know, in your life. And I, um, and I hope that, you know, that, that, that my whole reselling journey in general, um, you know, adds value to you as well. And this was, re this was my reselling journey number four. I hope you guys do enjoy this entire, you know, series of my reselling journey. And like I said, I hope it adds value and applies. And I hope you can apply this to your reselling journey or your life, um, you know, as you pursue your dreams. Um, so yeah, guys, I hope you guys have an absolutely amazing day. Keep loving the process, and I will see you guys later.